Welcome to the new episode of Let's Learn Maths with Teacher Net. I'm your teacher, Teacher Net. Imagine this stick as a straight line. Straight lines can be drawn in different directions. We have horizontal lines or lines that from left to right. And we have vertical lines or the lines drawn from up to down. When two lines meet, they intersect. And perpendicular lines are special type of intersecting lines. When the two intersecting lines form a 90 degrees or a right angle, they are called perpendicular lines. If we get any piece of paper and fold it twice, like this, One and two. The angle that is formed in this corner is a right angle. We can mark this like this. And we can use this corner to check if the lines are perpendicular. Put the folded paper against the two lines, line MN and line PO. The lines meet at the right angle, so line OP is perpendicular to line MN. We write line OP is perpendicular to line MN. This symbol stands for is perpendicular to. You can also put ruler against two lines. The lines meet at the right angle, so line UV is perpendicular to line ST. We write line UV is perpendicular to line ST. And let's try to draw lines of a square grid, like this. Lines AB and BC meet at right angle. They are perpendicular lines. On the other hand, lines XY and Y Y, Z do not meet on a right angle. They are not perpendicular lines. Where can we see perpendicular lines? We can see them everywhere. The corner of your hunger sheets, the corner of your table, even the corner of your windows. Can you look around you? And tell me, where else can you see perpendicular lines? At this point, I will be teaching you how to draw perpendicular lines using a ruler and a set square. A set square is a special instrument used to draw perpendicular lines. There are only three steps. Step number one. We draw a line. I will name this line, line A, B. Step 2. Put the set square against line A, B. Like this. Step 3. Use the edge of the set square to draw line CD. CD. Line AB is perpendicular to line CD because they form a right angle. We can say Line AB is perpendicular to line CB. We can also draw a perpendicular line through a point. 
Now let's draw a line perpendicular to line YZ through point X. Simply, you just get your set square and put it on line, line YZ. And using the edge of the set square, draw a line passing through the point X. And name that line OX. Lines OX and YZ are perpendicular lines. So, line OX is perpendicular to line YZ. I have a challenge for you. Which dots should I join up to make a pair of perpendicular lines? Remember, we can label lines by naming them after the points they start and end at. So which points? If you answer lines AB and line BD, you are correct. Lines AB and BD will be perpendicular to each other. Here's another challenge for you. Use a set square to draw a perpendicular line through point A. Hope you enjoy this challenge. That's all for this video and I hope you learned something new about perpendicular lines. See you again to our next video. Goodbye!